everybody. My name is Connie Craig Carroll, and we are so delighted to have you with us for our biggest gemstone event of the entire year. I mean, two weeks out of every winter, Tucson becomes the international marketplace for buyers and sellers and everybody who loves gemstones. And it really has set the standard for our gem and mineral shows from around the world, because you see the most rare and the most exotic and the most collectible gemstones at that big show. So again, we are continuing on. We actually, here at HSN, we're celebrating the event until Jan uh, until February 15th, so it's gonna be so much fun. And guess who was there? Siobhan Sarna, our own resident gemologist, was there. And Siobhan, it's <laughs> all a buzz with everything going on about oh rare gosh. and exotics, right? It, it is so true, and yes, there was turquoise there, too. It, not enough though, Connie, I've got to tell you, not enough. So I know your show uh, for Chaco Canyon tonight is gonna be spectacular. And you'll see a picture, Connie, of a set that had a similar bracelet. And you could only get it if you bought the bracelet, the necklace, the earrings, and it was five figures, okay? five figures to buy that set. So this is definitely the place to pick up on all these gorgeous beauties. All right, back to you, Connie. I'll be hanging out telling you more stories about the Tucson Gem Fair throughout the hours. Thank you, Siobhan. We can't wait, because she's gonna be giving us all the insider information. Well, now I'm gonna introduce you to Jennifer Wan. She, of course, brings us Chaco Canyon. She is a member of the St. Carlo Apache tribe, and you really work as a liaison with the artisans and us here at HSN, and we have quite the show today, because everybody's <laughs> talking turquoise, and I was just on with Jay King yesterday, and he said there just wasn't enough turquoise. You were seeing less and less turquoise at the big Tucson Gemstone event, but because your artisans are right there, where that Sleeping Beauty turquoise was mined in Globe, Arizona, and the Kingman was mined in Globe, uh, Arizona, we have the best values and the most just incredible pieces. These are all handmade. We're gonna start with the Dream Catcher, where we're taking this from 99 to 74.90, it's on FlexPay for $18 and change to be able to bring that home. And this, by the way, would look beautiful on our wonderful liquid silver that we have coming up. Now, the great thing is today we're doing multiple strands of liquid silver, and then we have a three strand if you want something very, very subtle and elegant. But the dream catcher in this case gives us sleeping beauty turquoise, which is the most rare exotic collectible turquoise in the world. They haven't been mining Sleeping Beauty now for about four years. And even when they were mining it, the prices had gone up so much, so crazy expensive, because they were shipping it all to Europe, putting it in gold for thousands of dollars. So it is by far the standard which all turquoise is judged. And then the dream catcher, Jennifer, is one of the most recognized beautiful pieces in Native American artisanship. It is, and you'll see that uh, throughout the U.S. And um, uh, when you look at a piece like this, it just it, it screams out Native American. And being being told, being that is that um, there's a lot of uh, uh, stories out there that natives tell about the Dreamcatcher. And most of all, it's it is said to uh, to take all the negativity and all the bad things away from you. And from when you dream about it, and when you uh, have a piece like this, uh, you would set it up on your bedpost or either on your uh, window and when you sleep at night they say that all the bad dreams get caught into the turquoise and would hold the negativity there and so when the sun comes up it all trickles down onto the feather sometimes there's a feather attached mm -hmm. to it and and that will take all the bad stuff away from you wow and look at the size of this and again that high grade okay. sleeping beauty turquoise the finest turquoise in the world we have a hundred of these and I can't tell you how many people always request dream catchers because maybe you've visited some of the wonderful museums and you've seen dream catchers maybe you have heard the story of the dream catcher well here you have it with that open sterling silver wire work and the sterling silver surrounding it in the circle but then those nuggets of that perfect highest grade clear blue sleeping beauty by the way we have the item number for that liquid silver necklace there at the bottom of the screen if you want that i'm going to leave this one available for you because i know by the end of the show there is no question it will sell out because we have again and again and again people who want beautiful dream catchers and this is the only one that we have in 
in the entire show right now. Okay, next, something else, Jennifer, that we always get requests for, we get requests mm -hmm. for rings. Because we do a lot of bracelets, we do a lot of pendants, we don't necessarily do a lot of rings. Well, today, we're bringing you Sleeping Beauty Turquoise in a band-style ring. I never thought I would see the day where we could do Sleeping Beauty. I mean, Sleeping Beauty Turquoise at $59.90, under $15 on your charge card. I'm gonna take it off for just a second because I want you to see that turquoise is so amazing that it almost looks simulated, but it's not. It's set into a thick, you can see how nice and thick that sterling silver band is. And then it has the shadow boxing effect on the back of it, so it makes it pop even more. Now at this point, I have six through 12 available, so even the gentlemen could get in on this one if they chose to do so. But there's a reason why we all love Sleeping Beauty, Jennifer. The reason being, <laughs> I'm not trying to put on this necklace. Yeah, um, we're multitasking. <laughs> is that with the, for the Sleeping Beauty, it's the most sought after and the most rare right now. And um, when you look at it, it's because of the robin's egg blue. And uh, mm -hmm. although also for those of us who live out by the Sleeping Beauty mine, it reminds us of the woman that is lying on her back, the Sleeping Beauty. And when you see that uh, mountain in the sunset, you'll see her beauty in it, at its finest. And so that is why the Sleeping Beauty rock right here, the the turquoise is one of the most sought after in the Southwest. Well, and it has been, uh, the mining of Sleeping Beauty has been not happening for about the last four years. No, and unfortunately, um, it, it's not. And you know, a lot of people don't get to enjoy the scenery and especially having the, the piece of stone that it is right here. So again, for the last four years, they've not been mining this gorgeous gemstone. All that's out there is out there. There will be no more. I mean, you're seeing less and less Sleeping Beauty. Jay King was telling me even two years ago at Tucson, there was no Sleeping Beauty. And he said the prices on Sleeping Beauty were more expensive than gold because, you know, you can still get gold. You can still find gold. You can't get Sleeping Beauty unless you know someone who is willing to part with something that they've had for many, many years. And that's not going to happen. <laughs> Exactly, and it can command whatever price it wants. So if you want to own a piece of gemstone history, really a piece of gemstone history, this is it in Sleeping Beauty Turquoise. And again, you've got this nice, wide, thick, sterling silver band ring, and then perfectly matched flawless Sleeping Beauty stones across the front. We have fewer than 200, but I have every single size available for you. Mined right here in the United States, but it was mined probably 10 to 15 years ago because there's no active mining going on in the last four or five years for Sleeping Beauty. And even at the time they were mining it, most of it was being sent to Europe, being put in uh, 18 karat gold pieces, so it was very, very expensive. It is today the standard by which they measure all other turquoise. So to own a piece of that, to also own something that was mined right here in the USA. If you want the best of the best, this is it. And going back with the Dreamcatcher, I'm gonna update you too on the quantity on that Dreamcatcher, because I know we don't, 60? Okay, 60 people can get that Sleeping Beauty Dreamcatcher too, if you would like to get that one. But this particular ring is actually one that we have reordered and it has all perfect five-star reviews. So everybody that got this one, Jennifer, is in love with it. It is, and especially the, the artisan who made it. Uh, her name is Roberta Begay, and she was taught by her grandfather, and they come from a long line of silversmiths, and especially for the dream catcher that we've had before, that was made by Doreen Jake as well. And those, so the, the men and women that work on these uh, pieces that we have brought to HSN, uh, they worked out of their homes, and um, they are very welcome, or thankful for the people out there who, you know, come and get their jewelry. Okay, we'll let you know when that one is gone, but look at this one. Speaking of Sleeping Beauty, look at those big hunks of Sleeping Beauty. And then all of this sterling silver. Now, this is a big customer pick at $169. Today, we are doing it for you for $139.90, under $35 on your charge card. And there is so much symbolism in that feather design. You see that often in Native American handcrafted jewelry, and Jennifer will tell us why. But if you want this, people are already asking about it just back in stock at our lowest price ever and then the earrings that I am wearing a lot of you have noticed these already and wow you have great eyes okay here are the earrings that I'm wearing I love the new way to wear the hoop this is a inlay beautiful perfectly cornrow inlay hoop from 89 
That's where it became a huge customer pick, all the way down to $69.90. I'm just looking to see the, um, the type of turquoise that it is. Let's see. Let me just see if I can find that for you really quickly. Okay, so so it's it's the, the Zuni tribe that created it, but I'll find the type of turquoise before we get there. Um, I believe that looks like Sleeping Beauty it looks to me. Like it. So I'm thinking that's Sleeping Beauty. We'll find that before we get there and let you know for sure. But it's $69. Come on now. That's amazing. Okay, we are going to keep things moving because we do have so much to get to. And now we're going to talk about liquid silver. And liquid silver is a mainstay. And let's talk about even the design of the liquid silver. Uh, when you look at the liquid silver, you're going to see the small tubular beads that are on there. And uh, uh, that that is a big staple in uh, Southwestern jewelry, and especially if you go out to uh, uh, Navajo land, you'll see a lot of men and women wear uh, liquid silver, and especially in rows and rows of, uh, of it. And um, that uh, that also is a, um, a throwback to uh, the style of the high she beads and how women and men have, would wear it in, in layers and um, uh, different tribes they hold it to uh, uh, to it's for your status I guess you can say and like the more jewelry you wear uh, the more uh, of a higher status that you have and so that when you look at this uh, this is uh, uh, the person who had made this had a lot of uh, uh, patience mm -hmm. and, and especially when you look when you look at a, a container of small Tubular, tubular beads that are like this, it's very time consuming. And, you know, I'm thankful for the artisans that who have made it, you know, because a lot of people ask for the liquid silver jewelry. Yeah, I'm going to show everybody this and then I'm going to count the strands for you because <laughs> for whatever reason they didn't put that on my blue card. It's very important that you know how many strands you're getting. These are multiple strands and we've taken it to our lowest price ever. We have the 18 inch, which is traditionally priced at 89, even though it would be um, appraised at $168. We do it for we're doing it for 79 today. Then we have the 24 inch, which is over $200 value that we've taken down to 109. It's on FlexPay for 27.48. And then the 30 inch, which is always the most popular. People have been ordering that since that hit HSN.com. It's the most limited. And we took that from a $223 appraised price to just 129 and on flex pay, you can break that up to 3248. But let me start by counting the strands um, because we do have coming up next hour what we call starter liquid silver pieces, but I wanna count these strands just to make sure exactly how many you have. And I also wanna show you a couple things about the liquid silver. What you can see, and you probably think they look like just lines of just liquid silver, but they're actually, see that? They're little beads little silver beads that are strung onto this cord. It is one of the most difficult things. Like there's a handful of artisans, right, Jennifer, that can even do that. Oh, yes. <laughs> I've tried and I, I didn't like it. I didn't, I, so yeah. So hard. I mean, you have <laughs> to have great <laughs> eyes, you have to have great skill set. Okay, so let's, great patience, like you said, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14. I think there are 14 in that 18 inch. And then I'm gonna grab the next longest and see, they should all be the same, but I'm just gonna check. Four, eight, 10. Yeah, I think they're all 14, but let me just check the longest one too. And we are crazy busy. If you can, I would get a couple of these and lay them back, layer them back together because you were mm -hmm. saying that's the way that the Native Americans really wear them. Oh yes, and then when you look at this too as well, uh, it could be the the bigger pendants that you have, the smaller ones. If not, you can just wear it by itself. Uh, you can wear this, you know, but going out casual and especially for business wear. And I, I love the style of jewelry because I have family members who have gone through my jewelry box and I have aunties who have taken them and wanted to borrow. And so, you know, a lot of men and women like this especially too as well. Okay, here's the, the thing. It's about 15 strands in each one. That's huge, 15 strands. The 30 inch continues to be the most popular and the most limited. 
And I will tell you, like I said, we have starter ones coming up next hour, so maybe we'll give you a sneak peek of those because we've never done the three strands, which are the, considered the, st the starter strands. But if you want the bigger, bolder ones, if you're looking to make a statement, if you're looking to layer, then these are the ones to go for. And when you see those retail values of over $200, that's really being conservative because these are sold in the really nice boutiques like in Scottsdale. And, oh, yes. Yeah. And they're sold at a higher price. And mm -hmm. so we're, you're very lucky to get it at the price that we bring to you today. Absolutely. And it can take, I mean, just to make one of these so long, right? Yes. Um, it could take between two to four days, five days, depending on the artisan who, uh, who does the stringy. Say that one more time. <laughs> <laughs> Between two to five days uh, oh, for an artist to make one necklace. To do one necklace, two to five days. Can you imagine working on one necklace, two to five days? And again, the, look at the silky, slinky nature of this. So beautiful. Okay, we will leave it available for you. I'll remind you about that too. And then also, the Dreamcatcher, we have 20 people who can get this from 99, where it's a big customer pick, all the way down to 74.90. It's $18 and change on your charge card. Or if you have your HSN charge card, $14.99 to bring that home. But then, lots of you love and collect crosses like I do. Here's your big, beautiful, this is a sleeping beauty cross. So that's sleeping beauty turquoise. $129.90 is our regular selling price, but we are going all the way down to $109.90. It's $27.48 on your charge card. There is a big possibility that we may not even get a chance to do a presentation on this because we have 60 people who can get that one. And again, you gotta think of the coveted, treasured nature of owning anything in Sleeping Beauty. So that's gonna be coming up for all of our cross girls out there. Okay, we're gonna move on to the feather. And this has been, of all the time that you've been here, of all the years, one of our single hottest selling pieces. And the reason is because there's so much folklore that revolves around the feather. By the way, we have 100 left, so a big portion of our quantity, about a quarter of our quantity already gone. We had this appraised, lowest appraised price, at $284, because there's a ton of silver in here. 284 was the lowest appraised price. We did it at 169, we sold it out the last three times it's on air. Today, best price we've ever done, it's 139.90, under $35 on your charge card to bring it home. And not only are you getting genuine Sleeping Beauty, this is real Sleeping Beauty in big premium quality pieces, but this is three and three quarters of an inch of the length, 15 sixteenths of an inch of the width, all hand done. And then there's, the, and by the way, it looks great back on the liquid silver. Then there's the symbolism of the feather. And uh, this is a, a favorite pick for me. Um, when I first seen the, my samples of the jewelry, and this is one of the pieces that I've picked out being that it, it is a symbolism of everything that I believe in. And for uh, the different birds that are out there, different Native Americans use the feathers for the, the healing purpose of it, for uh, just um, the, the things that the negative, they make the negativity go away and especially having turquoise in it, it just makes it especially powerful. And uh, for me, this is a, use, a unisex piece. Men and women can wear this. I've seen it on cowboy hats. I've seen it on scarves, uh, belts, and uh, purses. And so uh, when you see this, it's very powerful. It calls out to you. And um, the artist in here is Lloyd Martinez. He's been one of our master silversmiths for a very long time. And uh, when you look at the feather, uh, they say it's like, it's a soul and it's someone that is supposed to be there supposed to be there to protect you and um, uh, there's also been tribes out there who has have laid out feathers for people who have come into their uh, to their tribe to welcome them as friends and there are warriors out there that uh, the chiefs have given uh, feathers to them uh, as a, a symbolism of their bravery and then there's also the eagle who's one of the most powerful birds that are out there and uh, uh, for Native Americans he is revered as a, a, a sacred bird a symbolism of freedom for 
everyone out there. And when you see this, you know, we hope that you would enjoy uh, this piece of Native American treasure for yourself. Well, and again, just back to all of those reasons that we see so much of the feather in the Native American beautiful artwork, whether it happens to be jewelry or paintings or sculptures, you've got that big feather. And then you have the Sleeping Beauty turquoise. They just told me with everybody on board, I have 40 people who can do it. Please remember, it was $169. We're doing it today at our best price ever. The Dreamcatcher is sold out. We have other beautiful pendants coming up. I'm gonna leave this on until it's officially gone, but we're gonna tell you more about the Monday Night Show. Please stay with us for more Chaco Canyon. What's a better way to start your week than with me? What's on tonight? It's the Tucson Gem Event Takeover. Your favorite jewelry guests just got back from the big gem show in Tucson. Victoria Wick, Carol Brody, and Jay King discovered new jewelry, and we have them all, Adam. Plus, get a sneak peek at Colleen Lopez's Tucson Gem Today special. The night couldn't be more dazzling. It all starts tonight at 7 p.m. say congratulations to Hillary Scott, Grammy Award winning artist. So we are delighted to have her coming here in May. You'll see her right here live on HSN with her fashion line. So make sure and check that out. Okay, we do have 20 of the big feather pendants left. So we're going to leave that available for you. But now we're going to move right along. And we're going to talk about, we've been talking about sleep and beauty. Now we're going to talk about Kingman. And Jay King was telling me at the Tucson Gemstone Show, which obviously, like we said, is the biggest gemstone show in the world. He said there literally was almost no Kingman, but he said what there was available, people were paying five times as much as he paid just a couple years ago because of the fact that there's not an active situation going on with acquiring new Kingman turquoise. So this is exciting that we can do this. We have our beautiful five row bracelet, which was appraised at $820. That was the lowest appraised price, $820. We would do it for $4.29 today. It's $3.99. We have 80 of those. The matching ring, and this sold out the last time it was on back in August. We sold it out at $1.79. We're doing it for $1.39, and it's available for you on FlexPay at $34.98, or if you have your HSN charge card, $27 and change. But this is a completely different look, just in the way that they've put this together. And then also, too, tell us about the artisans that create this one. Uh, there are two artisans here uh, for the bracelet. His, uh, his name is Anton, and he's from uh, the Zuni tribe out in the uh the southwestern part of New Mexico, northwestern part, I'm sorry. Mm -hmm. And um, the for the ring, uh, it is made by Be Beavis Massey, for, also a Zuni tribe member. Uh, they are uh, instilled in keeping their uh, tribal uh, uh, artwork together, and especially for the for the the lapidary that they do and, and the silver work that they do. The Zuni are known for their needlepoint uh, turquoise jewelry, and um, this is what we bring to you from uh, out the southwest. And we're starting to go out into the tribes, the Zuni tribes, and bringing in more uh, artisans in and, and showcasing their jewelry just in hopes that we, we can give them exposure to as well as Navajo artisans. Now, do they, um, the different tribes have different specialties? They have different specialties, different ways of doing their jewelry and especially for their uh, family, uh, their family uh, era, their family name, uh, they have different style makings and so these are two types of uh, Zuni tribal making jewelry and so uh, the artisans there are very well known for what they do and this is what we bring to you today. Well, and the Kingman Mine, again, located in northwestern Arizona, is one of the oldest turquoise mines in the United States and known for its rich deposits, but also, too, known for the rainbow of colors that you can find. Jay was telling me that typically, um, in a turquoise mine, you find the same color. Mm -hmm. But in Kingman, it has all different colors, all different ranges. And so it is a just like a treasure trove of turquoise. But today, because, again, of the situation with the mining, they are paying, people are paying five times plus 
what they paid just a couple years ago for the Kingman turquoise because it's just not there. And he say, he was saying that, you know, he and Marty have always been best friends. Marty was his <laughs> best man at his wedding. He goes, but money talks. If they're paying him five times more than, you know, than I paid him originally, he said he's obviously going to sell it to them. So the fact that we can bring this to you and we can bring you one-of-a-kind pieces, because that's one of my favorite things about Chaco Canyon. These are all handcrafted by Native American artisans one at a time. So you're never going to have two that are exactly like. In fact, if you want the bracelet right now, I have 41 people who can get the bracelet. And even just the way that they've uh, created this, that's amazing, Jennifer. It is, and especially if uh, you were to actually pop one of them out, it'd be very difficult for the artisan to put it back together. It's very time consuming. That's why they only can make about maybe two or three per day, if, if, if even that. And um, for the artisan too, they have to work well within their means, especially with the turquoise that they have, because that's their only source of income. Okay, we have less than a minute left to shop. And remember, there's only one more Chaco Canyon show. That's tonight at 2 a.m. So if you know you're not going to be up at 2 a.m., this is really your chance to get those treasures, those Native American, not inspired, but true Native American pieces handcrafted, literally embodying centuries of old traditions because they passed down the traditions of making jewelry. Oh yes, for Navajos and especially the Zuni artisans, what they do is they have uh, schools within their community to uh, uh, to give the younger generation uh, a chance to learn, you know, their their the skill of uh, silversmithing, lapidry, and especially to um, own their way into the um, this, to the southwestern jewelry making world. Okay, do us a favor and hang in there. You've got this if you're on board. I know we're showing you a lot, but get to remember each piece is limited now. We have lots coming up as we're celebrating the Tucson Gemstone Show. And in fact, like I said, Siobhan was there. She's our resident gemologist. She's going to tell us some more. Connie, it was such a blast. I was thinking about Chaco Canyon the whole time I was there. We've got something going on with our Tucson Gem Event trivia. The first question is on our poll on hsn.com. So we want you to join in. It's hsn.com slash join in. And the question is, where was the first Tucson Gem and Mineral show held other than Tucson? Was it a convention center, an elementary school, or a public park? Now remember, this came up very organically in the town of Tucson, and now it's so big. It's the number one show in the world for gems. And 25% of you said convention center, 50 said the elementary school, which is right, and then 25 said public park. So I hope you will participate because we're doing a lot of that through the next couple of days on hsn.com slash join in. And stay with me next hour. I'm gonna highlight what else is hot and new from the Tucson Gem Show. Back to Connie and Jennifer. Thank you, Siobhan. We look forward to hearing that. Okay, now, you know, a lot of people, Jennifer, they shop with you every time Chaco Canyon is here to get those true collectible pieces. That's what we're about to show you. If you are looking for the best of the best in this collection, this is it. Now, with that being said, we have 20 of these. This is our beautiful, I mean, you look at the size of this one. This is Kingman Turquoise in this gorgeous necklace. Now it's actually a two in one design and I'm just gonna turn this around and show you. If you wanted to take this off, you could take this off and wear this just as a collar necklace and I'll turn it around to show you what the collar would look like. So you could wear this just as a collar or you can wear this as a drop pendant. You're getting everything you see here. This was appraised at $1,575, $1,000. $575. We're doing it for $829. The flex pay is $165.98. And it is out of this world gorgeous. Tell us about this one. Uh, this one, I this one I thought this is very unique when I first seen it. And um, I had a girlfriend and I who were looking uh, at the samples again and uh, she picked this out and she's like, uh, how do you wear this? I've never seen this. And and I was intrigued too. I was looking at it and I flipped it over, I flipped it back, I took off the, the pendant and I clasp it together then she's like well maybe it's worn as a band too like for your head and she put it on mm. her head as well and so we were playing around with it she liked it and I had a, I have a friend who is a cowboy too as well and he put that on his hat and so just uh, if you look at it it's it's universal I guess you can say in the, in the way you wear it and but this is one of the most unique pieces that I've ever seen and um, I was very proud to show it off and just especially to talk to people about it who had questions about it as well well and you look at all of the beauty of the collar portion, by the way, less than 20 of these now. If you wanted to wear this as just a collar, 
you could do that. You could easily take, just with the little hooks, you can take the, the center portion off, and then you wear it as this turquoise collar. And when you look at the collar, first off, you can see that it's going to contour to your neck. It's not going to be flat. And then all the way around, you have that beautiful Kingman turquoise. But even on the inside, you have that hand stamping. Now, that's obviously a detail they didn't have to put in there, but they did just because, you know, they wanted it to be perfect. And then even down to like these little, um, almost like little stars, that's something Gosh. very indicative. Of, Actually, I just wanna show you yeah. things I should have pulled out earlier. Um, let's see. I have uh, these little stamps. Mm -hmm. Actually that, um, if you look at the tips. Yeah. Here we Those go. Those are actually made in to make the indentations on the inside of the collar. So can you imagine you're someone you're, sitting there? Yeah, yes. you're going through and you're taking this stamp and you're stamping. See how it makes that you're stamping this up to create those perfect. They look perfect. And they've stamped all of that individually. That's amazing. And actually, this is a piece of uh, a silver, mm -hmm. too, that the, it's, um, you have it as a bar. And the person who's doing the, the designing, you know, does the stamping throughout the whole way. Wow. And this was made by the artisan Raymond Delgari. So he's also, again, one of our master silversmiths. Okay, we have 13 people who can get this. We'll let you know when it's officially gone. But two beautiful looks in one with that detachable turquoise drop in that gorgeous scalloped framework. It's brand new today. Okay, and then everybody's been asking, you know, I said, I kind of let the cat out of the bag. We're doing something we have never, ever done before. We are bringing you starter liquid silver pieces. So next hour, if you want a three sta strand, excuse me, three strand, 24 inch, I mean, it would be a great bargain at $34.90. We are doing it for $20. $9.90, $29.90. And then we also have the 18 inch instead of 29 for that, we're doing it for 24. The flex pay, listen to the flex pay on this. The flex pay using any charge card, $6 and change to get the 24 inch, I mean, sorry, to get the 18 inch home. If you're getting the 24 inch, it's $7 and change. But if you use your HSN charge card, $5, $5, $4.99 to get the 18 inch home, $5.99 to get the 24 inch home. And this will work back with every single pendant. And I mean, it's perfect. You can layer these, you can wear this back with your heavier um, liquid silver pieces. This is something we've never done and you all have asked for it. Oh, and we've got to update you. My pendant is officially sold out. So thank you, thank you for your calls there. But we are definitely gonna be moving right along and now we're doing my pick of the entire first hour, and if you blink, you may miss this one. This particular piece actually sold out um, the last time that we offer, I'm sorry, no, 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 no. This is based on one that sold out, reading my notes, this is based on one that sold out the last two times we offered it. We couldn't do that one again, but what we could do is bring you a brand new version. Now we have small, medium, we have medium, large available, and the detail in this, I'm gonna let you hold this for a second as I change my necklace, the detail in this is unbelievable. I have 130 people who can do this. Oh. First off, look <laughs> at the size of the stones, and that that's all Kingman. I mean, those are big 20 by 15 millimeter ovals. And then the design and the detail in that beautiful, beautiful uh, bracelet itself. I mean, that is second to none. Then you look on the inside. Yeah, tell us about that. Tell us about the styling of it. Uh, you have the, the stamping here that is made by Gilbert Smith. Uh, he is one of our silver, silversmiths that's been with us for over 15 years. There he is. And um, right now he's starting to teach his grandkids the art of silversmithing so they can start to fill, into it, fill in his shoes and go on their way to be a master silversmith just like him. And talk to us about the style. I mean, like, if we can go take a tour through the bracelet and show everybody the styling on it. Well, we're here you have uh, five uh, uh, stamps of turquoise and um, that is to show you the, the meaning of uh, the sky and water, the sky stone being the turquoise that you have here. Um, the story behind is that uh, 
for different natives, they say that when, before there was men and women to the Father Sky had appreciated, you know, water and Mother Earth so much that uh, what he wanted to do is show a symbolism of uh, her true beauty. And um, so when man came about to be, he, what he had done is that he made a piece of himself to give to man to show appreciation for women, which was uh, the stone of turquoise. And it, it is said to believe that it is an honor of Mother Earth uh, because what she does is she heals and she protects uh, those of us around us and she feeds us if you take care of her. And uh, to show appreciation, a piece of turquoise is supposed to heal you, supposed to protect you and keep away all the neg negativity from you. Well, and I love too that we have the small medium, we have the medium large, so even the gentleman, if they wanted, would be able to wear this. And this will accommodate any wrist size because it's open in the back and you can squeeze it down just a little bit to accommodate your wrist size. And I want you to please, if you can, use Express Automated ordering. I'm going to say with everybody on board, maybe 50 people can do this. This, in my opinion, like if I could reach through the screen and hand this to you and have you feel the weight of the sterling silver, the heavy, heavy weight of the sterling silver alone. And we had it appraised at $740. We're doing it for $77.98. And then back to the detail that is all entirely done by hand. And then the matching of that gorgeous turquoise across the front and cherry picking and hand selecting, which is particularly hard to do with Kingman since there's so many different shades within the Kingman turquoise. And you know, when you think about it too, this is more than jewelry. It's art that has become the livelihood for many of the Native American artisans. And it's a way to keep their culture and their history and their spirituality alive, right? Oh yes. And it's especially for, again, for turquoise, just for an artisan to work within the means and especially the, the kind of turquoise that they have, what they do is uh, have a piece of turquoise right here that um, what, what they do is when they have it mined, um, they have a person go and cut it and then you have it uh, polished like that. And um, what you see is that, uh, that what they do is they cut out their turquoise, the, the clearest part the majority of the time, and uh, they work with it. And, and all the beauty that you have there is the jewelry that we bring to you today. They just told me in the medium large, we have 10 left. In the, I'm sorry, yeah, in the medium large, we have 10 left. In the small medium, we have about 30. I'm gonna leave this one on until it officially sells out because this is one of the biggest buys in the whole entire show. Now, everybody's asking about Valeria's cross. Here's the beautiful cross. Let's see. Okay, I thought we were gonna show it on her, but I have one here too. Oh no, you know what, we have 15 remaining. We sold the majority of them off of a little preview. We took this from 129 to 109. It's 2748 on your charge card. $27.48 on your charge card. That is two and 13 sixteenths of an inch in the length one and three quarters of an inch in the width. You have the little sawtooth bezel design holding in all of that sleeping beauty turquoise. That will be sold out. And then we're gonna show you, oh, if you're looking for a perfect pair of sleeping beauty earrings, $59.95 for sleeping beauty, $59.95 from $79 to $59.95, there's only 75 pairs remaining, but here's an example of what every piece of turquoise in the world would love to look like. $14.98 on your charge card to be able to bring those home, but you see they're perfect little flower design and you own a piece of gemstone history, a, a, a type of turquoise that no longer is being mined. Okay, we're gonna tell you more as benefit returns to HSN, but stay with us as the Tucson Gym event uh, continues as well. San Francisco is the home to a little bit of everything, including Benefit Cosmetics. As former models, Jean and Jane Ford knew the challenges women faced with makeup. Their solution? To create their own line focusing on solving women's beauty dilemmas. Today, Maggie and Annie carry on the family tradition. And those same products are still some of the most famous instant beauty solutions around the world. Like our mom and aunt always say, laughter is the best cosmetic. I'm Joy. I'm a mother. That's first and foremost. I'm curious, always curious. I'm a bit of a perfectionist, and I'm an inventor. So when I'm designing product, it's all about making everyday life simpler. I guess that's just how I look at things. I find a lot of inspiration from just living my everyday life. And I think, boy, every day's a gift. 
make joyful discoveries every day. Jennifer Wan, and of course, continuing to celebrate the Tucson Gemstone event, our largest gemstone event of the entire year, and we are moving right along, and now we're going to talk about the ring that I am wearing. By the way, believe it or not, we do still have a few, just a few of the cuff bracelet as well. We'll update you when that's gone, but this is Sleeping Beauty, so we're talking about, again, that Sleeping Beauty turquoise that people absolutely fall in love with. You know what I'm going to do? I'm going to put it back with my wolf watch that's coming up here in a second because I know I don't have very many of those but this ring is a gorgeous combination of sleeping beauty turquoise and then on top of that you're getting faceted blue topaz the blue topaz in this case is all round blue topaz it's almost four and a half actually it's almost four and three quarter carat and then the sleeping beauty right there in the center. This was appraised, the lowest appraised price at $315. We were gonna do it at $189, but today $169, $42.48 on your charge card to be able to bring that home. And we have six through 12 available. Now this is a big one and a half inch length, 11 sixteenths of an inch in the width. You can see how great it's gonna go back with the watch. But really, even if this is your first piece of turquoise, this is a stand alone piece, but the design of it is very, very much an, a kind of a traditional design, isn't it? Yes, and by the way you look at it, it's got a, more of a, it reminds me of a, a, a concho look. Mm -hmm. and, um, it does. And when you, again, you have the elements of uh, sky and water. Uh, the, the artisan here is Irvin Sosi. He's one of our newer artisans. He started out buffing the jewelry first, and but then he's being taught by other artisans like Mike Smith and, uh, you know, Rainy Del Rita, one of our, uh, a couple of our master silversmiths that we have. And so the artisans are, are coming out and they're to their own, uh, 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 jewelry, style of jewelry making here you have an uh, updated you know southwestern couture look of a, an older version of a, a ring you know it's kind of an updated version and so when you look at this a lot of women uh, see the the sparkly of the topaz there then you have the you know the southwest effect of the turquoise as well yeah and that sleeping beauty again you look at that color of the sleeping beauty look at this I, you were talking about the concho. Mm -hmm. This is what it's inspired by, yes. this gorgeous concho design. So if you love that traditional concho design, this ring is absolutely positively one that you're gonna fall in love with. And then I'm always amazed, Jennifer, and I read this in your reviews. I was reading the reviews, um, I think on Sunday, I was going through Chaco Canyon on hsn.com <laughs> and reading the reviews, which I always encourage you to do that. People talk about the level of detail, like in the bezels and the thickness and the silver and even the beautiful beads in the silver, and that's all done by hand. It is, and especially with the bezel that you have there, it's a sawtooth bezel, and I have a piece of silver here that's got the little teeth marks that are on it. You can barely see it, but uh, if you have it up close, what you see there, you see that wrapped around each and every uh, stone that is on the, the ring there, and so the artisans work, you know, from morning to night. They work within, the, within their homes. A lot of them live in their Hogan's out on the Navajo Reservation, and uh, what they do is they work within their means, and these are the special pieces of uh, jewelry that I bring to you today. Well, and the length on this is absolutely stunning. One and a half inches in the length. Again, 11 and sixteenths of an inch in the width. I love it back with that concho pendant, and the concho pendant happens, happens to be on a major sale today. We only have a hundred of them, but you can ask about that if you would like. But the ring, look at how that blue topaz just twinkles, and then it leads your eye into those fancy pear shapes with the Sleeping Beauty, which is, again, the ultimate type of turquoise. But talk to us about this, this sawtooth bezel. How do they do that? How do they create the little sawtooth? The little sawtooth, I think actually uh, what they do is they, they cut it out individually and uh, uh, it is soldered together when you have it wrapped mm -hmm. around the stone. You have it uh, uh, soldered onto the plate of silver, which makes the, the ring in itself. And so they what they do is they work around the stone and, and make their design and that is what, how they come up with their artworks. And so with this, this is rain inspired because rain is crucial to us, uh, the water is crucial to us. And they say when the spring rains come, what, the, what a person must do 
do is they go outside, have their hands out, and they bless themselves. They put the water on their face and they pray for everything that, you know, is new, that, you know, the world can be fed again by what M Mother Nature has given us, which is water. And so that is what the, a lot of the artisans do. They put, pay homage to Mother Earth. I love it. Okay, and again, $20 off for the big event. $42 and change on your charge card to be able to bring this home. If you have your HSN charge card, you can do $33 and change to bring that home. And it is a big first come, first serve with the final few that we have remaining for you. We're gonna show you a couple of other things that are available as well. Quick update for you. Lots of sellouts already this hour. Our cross pendant is gone, but we do have a cross pendant next hour. And guess what else is gone? You have great taste, our beautiful sleeping beauty earrings are officially gone too. So congratulations on those as well. We got a couple things that we may not have a chance to show you, but they are available. This is the charm ring. Oh, oh you've gotta be kidding me. Let's see, how many do we have of this? Oh, we've only got 42. Okay, 42 people can get this. That big elongated piece of turquoise, the blue topaz that dangles down. We took this all the way down to $99. It's under $25 on your charge card if you wanna bring that home. That is absolutely stunning, absolutely stunning. And then we also have Ooh, this is another one. This is a completely different look. This is our cornrow turquoise inlay ring from $79 to $64.90. It's 1625 on your charge card. But what you gotta realize is this isn't carved. These are little individual pieces of turquoise that have to be cut to fit into this design. And they have to be precise. They can't even be off by a fraction of a millimeter or they won't fit into the ring. And so that is, there are a handful of artisans in the entire world that can do cornrow inlay. Here you can see that fabulous cornrow inlay, the beautiful little designs of the, the stars on the side of this. And you have that all for $64.90. 497931 is the item number, but we're gonna move on to the watch. And we always have so many requests for watches. Anytime we bring a watch, they always sell out. So here today, we're giving you one with a wonderful story associated with the design. You have that turquoise color to the face, and then you're gonna get the turquoise itself on the side of the watch. So here you can see gorgeous turquoise dial, but then you have the turquoise running down the side of the shank, and then you have the wolves. You actually have four wolves at the top. Now, this is a lot of Sleeping Beauty turquoise because you're getting nine pieces of Sleeping Beauty on either side. And then there you can see all the beautiful wolf detailing and the way it stands up off of the timepiece itself. In the back, you have a toggle style closure. So this is really easy to get into and out of and it's gonna accommodate pretty much every wrist size because it's adjustable. Appraised at 435, we're doing it at $30 off. It's 229 and 45.98 on your charge card, but it's the beauty of the bracelet with the practicality and the functionality of now a timepiece. And talk to us about the wolves. Uh, for the wolves, uh, they, there are many different stories behind the wolves, and one is that uh, they are uh, one of the most family-oriented uh, of um, cre creatures out there. They say that with the wolves, they stay together in packs. They defend each other. And at night, they sing uh, to each other. You hear the howling the, the, the howling of the wolves, you know, on a full moon. Uh, some, peop some stories say that, you know, when the moon looks up, they say that they are yearning for the love that they can never have, which is the, the moon, because they, within Navajo uh, stories, they say that the, the moon is also a woman who, uh, uh, at night, you know, she saw, she shines and, you know, mesmerizes people with all her beauty. And for the wolves, they say that, you know, uh, a long time ago that the, the, the wolf was a man and that the moon was a woman that uh, that he desired. And since he couldn't have her when she shown herself every single night, you know, he would cry out to her in hopes that he would go in, you know, be, one day become and, you know, be with her. And so that's why there are different stories out there, you know, within Native, Native American lores that uh, with the wolves, you know, they, they sing each night to her in hopes that, you know, he would, the, the, the moon would hear her, hear them. And so with the wolves, uh, the artist in here, his name is Raymond Del Garito. He's one of our master silversmiths. And uh, so he has the wolf pack there, <laughs> the wolf pack there, you know, protecting you as you wear it. It's beautiful. And I mean, the detail in this, you can't really see it there, but I mean, when you see this in person, 
The detail and design on that piece is second to none. It's amazing. And do the different um, artisans have different animals that they particularly gravitate towards doing? They do, and especially they say that that is your, your spirit animal, your talisman, someone or something that you want it to be or you, someone you want, something you want to embody. That's why a lot of artisans, you know, make it, uh, a lot of their jewelry either out of, you know, horses, eagles, or for instance, here, wolves. Okay, and I have a horse pendant coming up next hour. I'm going to leave the watch on. We have 12 people who can get the watch, but the next cuff, if you don't get this cuff immediately, you won't get it. Every single time. This to me is the most authentic kind of antique look we offer in Chaco Canyon. And every single time we do something similar, it sells out, usually off hsn.com. This is Sleeping Beauty, turquoise, all of that is Sleeping Beauty. This was appraised at $765. We're doing it for $399. The only bad news about that is, is I have 40 people who can get it. I'm gonna pick this up because I wanna show you. It's completely adjustable. If I wanted to bend this out flat, I couldn't. I'm not gonna do that, but I could. The point is, it will accommodate pretty much any wrist size. And then you have these perfect pieces of Sleeping Beauty. By the way, that's all silver. And then you're gonna get that tiny sawtooth bezel around each and every one. Oh, wow, we have about 24 people who could do it. So before it's gone, tell us about this. This is really an antique style, right? This is, and especially for the artisan here, uh, this is Judy Wallace. She's from the Zuni tribe. And um, for they're, well, they're known for their needlepoint work, and this is one of their needlepoint designs. It's very similar to the Navajo uh, uh, designs that they have, uh, similar to this. And um, you'll see a lot of this on, uh, on cuffs, uh, cuffs uh, rings, belts, and especially uh, necklaces that they have. And um, uh, for the needlepoint design, it's very time consuming, especially for the lapidary that they do. And and um, so with this, the artist can make, can, artist can send, can make about maybe three uh, cuffs a day. Oh my gosh, it is gorgeous. So again, about three of these a day, which is still pretty amazing. And you're getting the world's finest turquoise. You're getting the Sleeping Beauty turquoise. You're getting something that's completely adjustable. So if you have a smaller wrist, not a problem. It was appraised at $765. I'm gonna tell you, I think that's very conservative because if you've ever been out to the Southwest, you know if you go into a gallery and they have one of these, they can put any price they want on it because it takes mm -hmm. so long to create even one of them. But then the level of detail and design in these beautiful pieces and the fact that all that Sleeping Beauty is matched perfectly. You're gonna see the perfect matching. And then tell us about this. Uh, with that, you have the, the twisted uh, bezel there that you're, you're gonna see around the, the cuff, and that is what a lot of the artisans use for uh, their, their cuff making. And um, when you see that, you, you just see the different styles of uh, silver that they have, that they have to work with, and what they, uh, uh, what makes the whole uh, cuff in itself, and you'll see from the rock to the to the stamping to the hand uh, soldering, you see the silver uh, balls that you see there. That that is even time consuming too as well. And I was told that the artisan you know has to learn first from the master silversmith you know how to do different levels of silversmithing, and that's the start. Okay, and again, that's from the Zuni tribe. The Sleeping Beauty turquoise. We'll let you know when it's gone. Twelve left. Guess what sold out? Our watch is officially gone, but I believe. I believe we do have another watch coming up next hour, but before we do that, okay, I mentioned this one time, our liquid silver. We have never offered liquid silver in the three strand, ever. And if you go to the galleries, they start with the, actually, double strands, not even three strands, strands. they start with the double strands, and often it can be $75 for two strands. We're giving you three strands in the 18 inch today, at $24.90. Now again, that's just while they last. And then if you want the longer one, we have the 24 inch and it's $29.90. The flex pays around $6 using any charge card we accept or if you have your HSN charge card, around $5. But this is true handcrafted liquid silver in a triple strand. So you can see, a lot of people don't realize it's not just a, a string of silver. It's actually little individual beads, if you can see that. 
that they string on there one at a time. So you think of something as thin as maybe a safety pin, like the pin part on a safety pin. That's how they're stringing this on there. We're already crazy, crazy busy. I'm gonna show you how great this is gonna look with your pendants too. I'm gonna put that um, beautiful pendant that I have coming up next hour. This is a little more than $300, but we only have a handful. But see how it, it lets the pendant be the focal point, but then it looks like it's in that dripping liquid silver. Now we do have the larger ones available, but for a lot of us, we want these at under $25, and I have never seen anywhere else that does that. No, and especially for the price that we have it in, the different sizes, the different strands that we have. We've had it for uh, every single year that I've been on, a lot of people always ask for it. We've had it in bracelets, earrings, and necklaces. For the necklaces, the people won't stop buying them, and so we Bring thing, we, bring, we bring them to you in different prices, and so we hope so that you continue to buy more. Well, and it's great, too, because you can layer. Now you can layer your, you know, triple strand back with your bigger strand if you choose to do that. Or if you're just getting into the beautiful Southwestern jewelry, you're going to have the, the, you know, opportunity to kind of mix and match and build that wardrobe. But you can see, even putting a substantial pendant on it, it looks amazing. Now remember, we have four flexible payments. If you're using your charge card, you can actually do the additional five flexible payments. The most limited at this point, I do believe, is the 24 inch. So if you want that longer 24 inch, that's right now outselling the other one at about three to one. Look at this on though, and you can see how fantastic it looks. So whether you were just thinking, I'm not sure at this point what size I need, or it's your first piece of liquid silver, big, big, big customer pick, even at the original selling price, but now at our big Tucson gemstone prices, and I'd love for you to see how great it looks on, because it's really, really, it's just like wearing a strand of lights or a ribbon of lights. And you gotta think too, each and every one is individually handcrafted. So these are never mass manufactured. No, everything is made from the, the artisan's home and um, nothing is mass manufactured. You'll get a certificate of authenticity knowing that you're getting genuine Native, Native American jewelry and uh, each of the artisans, thank you for your purchases. And a lot of them are, are very uh, happy to know that those of you out there who have collected their pieces that, you know, they wanted to hear your stories of how, you know, uh, you've come about buying them or, you know, what other people have said to you. They like feedback on that. And so um, just tell us, you know, what you'd like in, in, in hopes that we continue to bring more pieces like this to you. Well, and that's a good shot right there because they can see the individual little beads, right? Mm -hmm. Oh yes, and especially for the artisans who are uh, beaters as well, they become silversmiths and uh, what they do is um, they, they kind of juggle the, the silver life back and forth, the bead work, bead work back and forth too as well. And so it's a great uh, mix and match for different artisans to come out and, uh, and enjoy their uh, Southwestern uh, jewelry making. You know, I'm gonna show you another, I'm trying to show you the pendants and they look great with the pendants. But I gotta tell you, a lot of people wear it just by itself because it gives you that really like that string of light or that strand of light effects. But here you can see it back with another pendant that we've coming up next hour. It's just that perfect, perfect chain to wear your gorgeous cross on. This cross, like I said, will be coming up next hour. It's a perfect chain to wear your big, bold pendants on. If you love something big and bold, like what we have here. Or if you just wanna wear it by itself, or if you love the idea of wearing pendants on maybe the shorter one and wearing the longer one to kind of create that beautiful layered look that is so very popular right now. If you've always wanted liquid silver, don't get the, the, the costume jewelry, the imitation look, get the real liquid silver, handcrafted by Native Americans. This is one of the types of jewelry that is, is one that um, we always see when we're talking about Native American jewelry, right? Oh yes, and especially when you look at this, uh, uh, we bring to you a lot of uh, pendants with big bills, and so uh, in hopes that you will get uh, liquid silver necklaces like this to, to have them on there. You can wear them by himself, or you can wear them with uh, beaded, you know, beaded pendants that you have. Anything, you know, mix and matches with this. Yeah, for sure. So I'll show you one more time. I've kind of got mine all jazzed up with different styles, but I wanted to do that so you could see 
that even if you're going big with your pendants, this is still so very appropriate. And look, so, look how amazing that looks. We're at almost 500 of these ordered. Again, if you know you want that 18 inch, I'm gonna tell you, we normally would do the 18 inch, I'm gonna give you all the information on it. The 18 inch is always $34.90. We're doing it at $29.90 right now. And then the fact that you can put that on FlexPay for $7 and change, and if you have your HSN charge card, $5.99, if you want the 18 inch, the 18 inch is always 34. We've taken it down to 29. It's on FlexPay for you at $4.99. It's over 600 people have ordered. You'll get a full presentation on that coming up next hour, but big customer pick even at the ori original selling prices so bear with us i know we're busy we're gonna get you taken care of but before we move forward with more of our tucson gemstone event and chaco canyon we're gonna check in with siobhan who is our resident gemologist hey siobhan hey you too you know we've been talking about turquoise this hour and i cannot think of a stone that has truly captured the heart of america more than turquoise can you from that heritage of course to that true blue color we love it what's there not to love you know we've been talking about what sets each type of turquoise apart and of course it's the color and it's the mine that it comes from and i just wanted to update you that sleeping beauty mine is closed but as i speak people are looking for a more high quality turquoise in the usa especially here in the USA. I don't know if they'll beat it, but I hope they can match it. And there was very little of it in Tucson. And that picture that you just saw right there was thousands and thousands of dollars. Doesn't it look like some of the treats and treasures that Jennifer has been bringing to us? And that one was over five figures that you had to buy the set. Okay, we're gonna wrap up in this little moment of Rock Talk. We're going back to Connie and Jennifer. Thank you, Miss Siobhan. We look forward to more of your rock talk. And I know Siobhan's going to be staying around for the Monday Night Show, too. I found our other big watch that's coming up. So I'm going to put that on, kind of tease you a little bit with that. But we're going to go ahead and get this second and final hour of Chaco Canyon started with some gorgeous. Now, these are stunning Kingman turquoise earrings. $225 appraised price. We were going to do them at $199. Instead, we're doing them at $119.90, under $30 on your charge card to bring it home. Now,